I know absolutely nothing, and that's okay. If you're in the darkness right now, I'm here to tell you there's going to be a brighter day. If you feel like you don't know where you're going, and you just maybe feel upset at yourself, upset at the world, upset about things that you can't undo that you've done in the past or things that people have done to you in the past that they can't undo and all of this is through an identification with your ego and projecting yourself into a past or future moment and you know, this is something that I struggle with daily, trying to get over getting lost in my thoughts about negative things that have happened to me, or things that I've done to myself, and things that, like the old person that I used to be, identifying with the fact that I used to be, you know, a different person that was not doing what I believe to be right, but if you understand that if you didn't do those things, if you didn't go through the bad times, would you have had a spiritual awakening or would you have become the person that you are now? The darkness can actually lead you into the light. If you're in the darkness right now, you need to see this. And I'm here to tell you it's time to pull yourself out of the darkness. You're the only one that can forgive yourself. You're the only one that can forgive, you know, just anything. It It's not like it has to even be something big. It could just be a really small thing that you just can't get over. And you just kind of want to keep pushing it away, pushing it away. Or just your life in general. You just don't want to, like... Face the fact that you don't, you don't really like how you're living, or you just don't feel fulfilled, and this is something that is so hard to deal with because it's like, what am I supposed to do? How am I supposed to, to ever live with my own thoughts that are always haunting me? And the way that you do that is being present and and actually feeling your body, feeling everything that's around you and actually appreciating it to the point where you don't even think, you don't worry about um, just like how, how things will work out in the future. You know that that things are going to work out perfectly. It's not like you don't visualize your future and think about things that you want to do. And you, it's not to say that you can't use your mind to help you. But the identification with the mind and the ego only and the body only is where people go wrong. And it's not, and I also have said on here, you know, you're not your body. But at the same time, if you don't appreciate that you came here and you're visualizing this body for a reason to experience yourself, to experience the pain so that love is heightened, to experience those hardships so that you were able to, to open your heart. And it's, it's something that I still haven't gotten over so many things that kept me in that dark place will you know, something will just remind me of it or you know I'm still in that place a lot now because nobody really around me completely gets what I'm what I'm doing on YouTube nobody really knows about my channel and the people that do you know they don't really get it that's besides the point that's that's what I'm saying that's all an identification with your ego and making yourself think like they have to get me they have to wake up they have to do this when in reality the best way to do that 
is to to learn these things for yourself and stop just constantly fighting yourself in your mind it's like the phrase i can't live with myself who is myself who is i are you just you or are you part of something that is so much bigger so when you when you sit and meditate in nature and just feel your inner body feel as Eckhart, Eckhart Tolle, Tolle, I don't even know how to pronounce his last name, to be honest. As he talks about in The Power of Now, the inner body, you want to feel everything inside. You want to be able to feel your body and not neglect it because that's where the repressed emotions and your intuition is coming from that's how you feel your intuition a lot of time you know you you get a a sense in your heart you get a feeling that something is is wrong that something is right you that you need to do something or you don't need to do something so know that you're not your mind you don't have to be lost in in thinking I'm, I'm my thoughts. I can't get out of this, this trap that I'm in and realize that you can create a new identity. You can create a new reality for yourself. You can become whoever you want to be. I was completely down, completely lost, and I had no clue what to do. And then I just had a feeling inside that I was connected to everything. That's what I'm talking about. When you feel it, you will know. You will see things in a whole new way. You'll see the sky in a way that you never saw it before. You'll see trees in a way that you never saw them before. It's almost like they're moving for you. Animals are coming towards you for you. Appreciate the the beauty in this illusion i don't know a single thing <laughs> as a human and it it's completely fine that we don't have to know everything about what we're experiencing that's why we're here and even learning information and facts can never teach you things that you cannot describe with words and that's what i've been learning about things that i can't describe with words things that are completely just a feeling inside that's true happiness it's going within it's not placing value on the external it's not placing all of your your love into another person or to a thing like money it's placing all of that love and that feeling that that person or that money or that job or that you know car career path that you want to take whatever it may be literally anything that feeling that you get from that that's what you need to focus on if you want to attract what you want. You need to focus on feeling that. Feeling that all the time. Just let things come to you. It's all going to work out in your favor. It's hard to say that when you're in a dark time and I completely understand. But please, just take some action today. Do something about it. Don't keep sitting in the darkness. Don't keep sitting in the shadows. It's time to shine your light because you came here to do something that, that we might not even be able to know about right now. That's how crazy this is. Think about you know everything that's going on on the planet right now. It's not normal. This is not normal, people, okay? how many people are talking about these topics right now 
This is the information age. We're all able to connect. We aren't going to be controlled by one little, little TV screen, one little newspaper, our own little group of friends. No, we can connect with people from all over the world. We can we can change things because we can see life from everybody's perspective making us realize that that it doesn't make any sense to to think oh my perspective is the best maybe we're all here to learn and we're all here to appreciate other perspectives and i'm guilty of this you know thinking i know things thinking you know but most of my videos are really just a message to my own self they're a message from my higher self to my ego telling me what i really need to do i actually have no clue what i'm gonna make a video about most of the time i have i just came out here started talking and it's like i'm talking to myself so when i'm in the dark night of the soul i'll be watching this video if you're in the dark night of the soul and you're watching this video just know that <laughs> the, the darkness doesn't last forever and without the darkness how could you ever see the light i love you all peace out